So right now I'm at the Google Forms website. I'm going to click go to Google Forms and then we're going to see this page. At the top, we're going to click start a new blank form. You could also pick a template if you'd like. Right now I'm writing a title for the form and also a description. So now the first question is going to ask for the user's name. We're going to make it a short answer question and also a required question. The second question is what food you're going to bring to this party. This is going to be um, also a short answer question and also required for now. The third question is are you even coming to the party and we're going to add options for this yes or no. So now we're going to edit um, the requirement for the third question because if you say no, you don't even have to bring food to this party. So we're going to turn off the requirement. And this is our sample form. Yours would obviously be different from this one as it is just a sample. On the top right, you want to click preview. This is how your form would look like. Um, so name, I'm just going to write a sample answer to show you guys how to connect this to Google Spreadsheets. So just write a random name and I'm just going to write pizza as my food. The user could also submit a different response. At the top right, we want to click edit. And here we could see responses. We want to click this green button and then cre create a new spreadsheet. We want to name it whatever we want. As you could see, our form that we just filled out is right here. It's right in front of our eyes. It's right in the spreadsheet. So let's say you're organizing a party and like a million people are coming. Spreadsheets actually organizes the data. You could also further enhance or organize the data using conditional formatting or also functions. So Today we learned how to connect Google Forms to Google Spreadsheets. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to Create Tech, hit that annotation above, and also please hit that like button. Let's see if this tutorial could reach at least 10 likes. Thank you guys. Create